Good day everyone. I don't usually make videos like this but if you want to see more reaction videos, comment below. On my YouTube home feed, I saw a video titled, Businessman Judges a Female Pilot. When I watched the video, I saw some things that kinda looked wrong. This video isn't to humiliate Dar men but to help their team in the future. Let's watch the video. Welcome aboard, sir. What is that? Only pilots are supposed to wear those, not flight attendants. You are correct, sir. However, I am not a flight attendant. I'm Captain Julie Billings. I'll be flying you to Orlando today. Come on, stop playing around. Where's the real pilot? I am the real pilot. The content of this video lives up to the title. There is a sexist guy on this plane who thinks a female cannot fly a plane. This is a problem in the aviation industry. There was a news article that was written in 2022 that spoke about how a number of customers have insisted they would prefer to travel with a man. In 2020, 5% of pilots were women and 1.42% of captains were female. I'll put a link to the article in the description. So having a sexist person on board an airplane isn't new. Also, here's the first mistake I spotted in the video. The pilot said, I'm Captain Julie Billings. This is false because the stripes on her shoulder suggests that she's a first officer and not a captain. If she was a captain, she would have four stripes and not three. Seriously? A woman pilot? Oh, that's just perfect. What is this world coming to? How can you just sit there being so calm? From first sight, I thought the cabin windows were rectangular. If you didn't know, there was a plane with rectangular windows. It was called the de Havilland Comet which was introduced in 1952. But why are rectangular windows not used on modern airplanes? In early 1954, two British Airways Comet jets crashed, killing 56 people. Investigations revealed a design flaw in the square windows, which caused high stress concentrations leading to fuselage failure. As a result, all Comet aircraft were grounded. By 1958, new models with safer oval windows were introduced to prevent similar incidents. Alright let's skip through this video to the interesting part. Okay this is ridiculous. We're already 10 minutes behind schedule. What is she doing up there? Her nails? How may I help you, sir? Why are we delayed? What is the pilot doing? Her makeup or something? Uh, there are thunderstorms over Kansas. Uh, we have to deviate around them. Uh, the captain and the tower are putting together a new flight plan. If the pilot is making a new flight plan, first of all, that's going to be a very long process because if they have to divert to another airport, due to the thunderstorm, this could mean more fuel may be required. Second of all, why is the captain in this video in the galley? They should be in the cockpit talking over the radio, which highlights another problem with this video. Okay, look, I have a very important meeting to get to. It's the kind of meeting that can make or break my career. I cannot afford to miss it because the pilot got lost trying to find her way to Orlando, you know what I'm saying? If they have to make a divert, there's a high chance of you not making it to your meeting on time. Don't worry. Captain Billings is great at finding ways to make up time in the air. Just be honest with me. We're just a couple of guys talking here. How much do you hate flying with a woman? I don't. Come on. You and I both know you could fly this thing better than her. He probably cannot, because pilots have to go through an expensive and long process of training in order to fly a plane. So, no he can't fly the plane. Well, not at all. Uh, Captain Billy just- Is someone who only got the job because of her gender. Yep, because airlines just want to put their passengers in danger by hiring a female who supposedly according to this guy did not go through pilot training. This is ridiculous. If I were the crew member on this flight, I would have kicked this guy off the plane for causing a disturbance, as flight attendants have the right to kick passengers off if the passenger is causing a disturbance. You know what would really be helpful? Replacing the pilot with a man. That's not possible, sir. Possible? Do you know who I am? I'm a very frequent flyer. I've been a customer of this airline for over a decade. I demand a new pilot, a male pilot, or I will cause a very big scene. 
got me. I understand. As the comm flight attendant said, it is hard to get a new male pilot. It would be even worse for this businessman as the plane would have to be delayed and he would definitely miss his meeting. Also, who cares if you are a frequent flyer of the airline? Airlines don't care about that. It's not like the airline goes into bankruptcy if you don't fly with them. Still ridiculous. Mr. Wilson, I hear you have a problem with me flying the aircraft today, is that true? You're darn right I do, Missy. And what seems to be the problem? The problem is, I have a very important meeting in Orlando to get to, and I don't think you're capable of getting me there. Because of my gender? Yes, everyone here is thinking it. I'm just not afraid to say it. Yeah, probably because everyone knows you are in the wrong. To help you understand this more, the number of US women airline pilots grew by 71% from 2002 to 2022. So as time passes, more females are becoming pilots. Let me point out, you've already put us behind schedule with this delay. Sir, the delay is due to a storm. Every pilot is rerouting, not just the female ones. Give me a break, honey. Sir, don't call me honey. I'm a captain, a rank and a title I earned. If you are a captain, why are you wearing three stripes? This means that you're a first officer. There's also a big difference between being a first officer and a captain, as a captain would have more responsibilities than a first officer. Earned? Mm-hmm. Oh, come off it. We all know how the world works. The airline hired a token woman to fly the plane so they could look good to their female customer base. You didn't earn anything. Back to sexism again. This guy is very confused with how the aviation industry works. It's just hilarious. And for your information, she's done this job so well that she was just awarded the Harmon Trophy, which is given to the country's top aviator. You may not like that I'm a woman, but I am the best pilot you will ever fly with, and my aircraft is the safest in the sky. Well, now the businessman has learned that she is very experienced. But let's not forget, she is the first officer, so along with the captain she is flying the plane. Fact remains, I have a very important meeting with Charles Sloan, and I don't want to die before I get there, so get me a new pilot, or I'll sue this airline into bankruptcy! What is it? What are you smiling about? You have a meeting with Mr. Sloan of Sloan's and Waters Enterprises? That's right. What do you know about it? Oh, boy. This is really not your day, Mr. Wilson. What does that mean? It means that Charles Sloan is my father. In fact, I took this shift so that I could go home for his 70th birthday. Hmm. You said your name was Billings. That's my married name. I see. Well, now he knows that he messed up. This is hilarious. Well, I highly doubt he's having any luck with that meeting. Well, to summarize the ending, he gets kicked off the flight. Well, that's the end of this video. Until next time, safe travels, and stay informed.